several rural communities in the big country will soon have access to broadband internet through a fiber optic system. KRBC's Catherine Garcia visits with residents in Hamby. The quiet countryside, like the flat land of Hamby, is exactly what four-year resident Sammy Holt was looking for. Sunshine's great out here. Air's great. I don't have to get a permit to burn my trash. Content without technology, when he found out about Hamby's new access to a fiber optic system, he wasn't exactly floored. I used to have internet in my job in Dallas. I had to have it. I had a limo's company. Out here, I don't need internet. And while longtime Hamby resident Gary Grisham loves the rural life as well, he says broadband internet was overdue for his daily life. We use it to, to watch TV. Um, we use it for Facebook and, and different things like that. And then my grandkids come over and do homework sometimes and they need to, to be able to get the, their information here. Along with leisure activities, Gary says the faster internet speeds will be especially useful for his family's auto service business. Because it speeds up our stuff so we can download uh, the things that need to be done. and, and uh, we have trouble trying to update our, our equipment there at the, at the office for that, so it's going to help that. And while the advancement in technology can benefit rural communities like Hamby, some citizens like Sammy Holt may prefer the peace and quiet. So whether you want to live life unplugged or scroll through Netflix, all Hamby residents can now choose which path to surf. In Hamby, Catherine Garcia, KRBC, Abilene's Local News.